In today's video, we are unboxing my new Nikon Z30 camera and sharing five of my favorite features. Let's do this. Hi, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Megan and I just started my first YouTube channel. This is video number six and I'm excited to see where this takes us. This is a little bit different of a type of video that I've been doing, but I wanted to share it with you anyway. My first two videos I recorded on another camera, but when I went to edit the footage, it was very grainy, even when filming in almost full sunlight. Walking with that camera resulted in unusable footage and I knew I needed to figure something out. I began to research options and a couple days later, two creators that I follow posted about a new camera. They were referencing things that I knew I wanted if I was going to invest in a new camera. I had switched to filming on my iPhone and that is okay, but I wanted to be able to get multiple shots, better stabilization, better low light filming, and better sound with a mic that mouths to the camera. So after talking it over with my husband, I did just that. I purchased the camera. Right now I am filming currently on my iPhone. Every light in the living room and dining room is on just to get enough light to be able to film. Yesterday, I received notice that the camera had shipped and was scheduled to be delivered today. I was so excited. Here it is. Woohoo! Before it was delivered, I was warned that an adult signature would be needed to accept the delivery. So heads up. So let's get to opening it. Ha! I chose the kit which included one lens. At this time, I don't have a need for a long length lens. So, let's get going. Let's see what's in here. A charging cable. So, first on my favorite feature is that you can plug it in while recording and keep going. I don't have to worry about charging the battery. Batteries are expensive and this only comes with one. So being able to plug and keep going sounded good to me. Here's the owner's manual and important paperwork. So I'm gonna set that aside so I can register my camera in case I have any issues in the future. My second favorite feature is the low light capabilities. Both of the creators that I saw talking about this camera were talking about how great it is in low light. Like I said before, every light in the house is currently on, to put it lightly, just so we can get this video filmed. Let's see what's in here. The strap, so I'll attach that later so I don't drop it. The battery. So I was reading that with this battery, you put it in the camera and plug the camera into a computer to charge it. So heads up, there's no battery charging station thing like some cameras I've had before. I don't know if that's a Nikon thing, this is my first Nikon. My third favorite feature is the red recording light that's on the front of the camera. That way, I always know I'm recording. My other camera that I was filming on, you couldn't really tell from a distance or even up close if you were recording without going around the back of the camera. The lens that came with this kit is the 16 millimeter to 50 millimeter lens. So it'll be perfect for vlogging on down the line. My fourth favorite feature is the swivel screen so that I can always make sure I'm in frame and in focus. Last but not least, the body. Wow, this is really light. I wasn't expecting how light this was. Here's the swivel screen I was talking about. So you can pull it out and you can turn it so it can be facing you. or it can be closed so it'll protect the screen from being scratched. My fifth and final favorite feature is that the tripod mount is located here compared to where 
the battery and SD card are located. So when my camera is on a mount or has the mounting plate on, I can still open up the battery compartment and change batteries, change SD cards, whatever I might need to get into. And the charging port is over here on this side. So you could plug in and like I said, keep recording. It is currently 10 p.m. so I'm gonna put this camera together so you can see a side by side of the difference in lighting and low light so you can see just kind of what I'm seeing. Let's see how well this low light feature works. I'm going to be using this all day tomorrow to film my video for Tuesday, so come back and join me. I'll see you next time. Bye!